Hello everybody, it's me Kay, and welcome back to Colony Survival. It's a beautiful day here in my labor camp masquerading as a town. And there's been a few updates, so we're back with the game to showcase a few new things about the game. It's been a little while, so please bear with me. Let me see now. I need to check my storage boxes. And I need to make some things, most importantly. Uh, one of the things I need to make is in here somewhere, technologist table, I believe. And that's going to need coated planks, iron ingots, and linen bags. And we are not even remotely ready to have that. Okay. So, hmm. We're going to have to get to the new technology level. Okay. These guys are busy doing their thing. We still, very fortunately, have access to uh, the weird infinity boxes that are linked everywhere. But uh, things are going quite nicely here in Colonyville. I don't know. I guess it's Canada. They look like the South Park Canadians, so I have already mentioned that. But if we need coated planks, then that means we need linseed oil and we need flax. In order to get flax, I'm going to have to head down here and have a little look-see around. We got plenty of food. We got plenty of arrows. Alright. What do we have? You guys are doing coal and copper. We need somebody on gold, I believe, because the only way to get flax right now is from the shop, which needs gold coins, planks, and stone bricks. Well, I suppose I could get some gold today. That might save me a little trouble. And what's it going to take to make a mint? Because I need a mint to get gold coins. Now, don't I? Hmm. Uh, a mint. It's not counterfeiting if the king says it's okay. <laughs> I love it. Need an iron ingot, planks, and gold ingots. Well, we got iron ore. We got coal. So we should have iron ingots around somewhere. Yep, there's some. I'm going to just steal that and that gold ingot as well. Drop this gold ore off. Uh, planks. Plankety planks. Okay. The mint can go up here. Mm. So I don't want to have to come down here very often. As you can see, it's rather annoying to traverse. But it was a good, quick way to get down to the ore, which we needed. All right, let's make ourselves some delicious minty freshness, I suppose. And we're going to need somebody to work this thing, which means we're going to need more colonists, which means we're going to need more beds. Oh, oh boy, what fun that will be. Okay, let's see here. That can get placed in one of my work rooms. Yeah, there's a work room over here as well, I believe. Yeah, we'll make this our new work area. Uh, get minted. Okay, and unemployed, no unemployed colonists left to take one remaining job, of course. Beds. Need beds. Need straw for beds. Got straw for beds. Got beds. Boop, boop, boop. Good enough. And Damn it. there we go. Boop. Okay. No, oh, I need a colonist now. Recruit a colonist. All right. So he's gonna meet. He has a gold shirt, so I assume he works the mint. That stands to reason the way this game has gone thus far. Yes, he is working the mint. He has nothing he can do right now, however. He's just gonna meander around. He'd like to work at the mint, but he doesn't really have very much he can do. Oh, he can go get some gold. Let me go, uh, let me poop out a little crate for you here, buddy. Oh, no, that wasn't what I wanted. Bloop, there you go. Okay, so you've got access to that. Now he's gonna make coins, and there you go, you can see coins. Okay, so I need... He needs gold ingots, which means I need a gold miner. All right, fine. Rec 
recruit a colonist. Let's go haul butt down to the mine again and quickly uh, scoot that colonist out. Okay. Let me set up a gold mining area. Let's delegate this to a miner. There we go. And we now have a gold miner. While we're at it, I'm just going to go ahead and mine a little bit myself to get things moving along. Boop. So I'm going to need some coins for the merchant, the shop. That will prove quite important. I'll just pretend to be a miner instead of the king of my stupid, horrible colony. What are you doing? Are you going to go to bed or what? There you go. Okay, it's bedtime apparently. So let's just drop off this crap. Doot, 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 doot. Mint, 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 mint. Okay. So we've got our mint built. What does it take for shop? Five gold coins, planks of stone bricks. That's not going to be a big problem for us. What happened? Something happened there. We've got minus one unemployed. Something weird happened. I think somebody got et by a zombie up there. Hmm. I'm going to need beds down here for the, the miner to work at, I suppose. Oh yes, there are definitely zombies coming in. I will be uh, spending the night here, it would appear. Hmm. Alright then, let's go ahead and make some beds while we're at it then. Might as well since we're here for the evening. There we go. Drop this stuff back off. One of your comments with job wheat farmer has died. One of your comments with job mentor has died. Oh dear. Oh, they're getting in. Something's wrong upstairs, man. Ah, we're gonna... <laughs> okay, I guess I can't go see what's happening, but yeah, colonists are getting wrecked somewhere. Hmm. That is indeed just extremely unfortunate, that. Where did that bed end up? That just ate a bed magically, okay. Well, there's a magic missing bed now. So I guess I'm making another one. I trust you guys to cover my butt while I'm doing work down here. Hmm. Please refrain from letting the zombies eat me. There. Alright, there's more workspace down here now so I can hire a miner that will probably take a bed down here. And we're getting... Damn. Can I get out yet? looks relatively safe up there. I would really like to know what's going on outside and why I lost people today. Because some people's got killed. Run, you fool, run. Uh, yeah, we lost like a miner and somebody else. Uh, a wheat farmer, I think. And then the minter died too for some damn reason or another. I guess they just failed to get inside in time, the dumbasses. And have you... Let's, let's keep people to these beds, if at all possible, please. And then the miners and etc. will go down there where they don't have to run up here in the middle of the night every night and get their shit kicked in by zombies. Maybe I should build a couple watchtowers and like a road there so that if I do need to have people show up over there they can get there safely. Yeah. Well, my guards are doing their work real well here. I don't know what happened to those other guys. They just kind of died. 
It's a big old mystery. Well, it's almost daylight, so I can uh, rehire the relevant people that I needed. Go ahead and do that. Let me call this job. Bogard has died. Bogard has died. Oh, no. The zombies are getting too... Too bulky, man. Oh, yeah, they killed some guards over here. Crap, I'm losing guys. Oh, yeah, look at them. They're dead. They killed my bow guys. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Recruit, 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 recruit. There. The jobs are filled again. Now I need to really take a good look at my defenses here. I'm going to need more bow guys. They just did not adequately protect the outside that time. Uh, so let's make some more bow guys. What, am, I, am I flying? What was that? I don't know what the hell's happening there. <laughs> Something was weird about that. Okay. Uh, boop. And boop, that should take care of that. Let's recruit two more bow guys. Yeah, the zombie spawns are getting a little intense. Uh, I need more beds, crap. Okay, I guess I'll replace these beds then. Doot, doot, doot. Good enough. Recruited colonist, recruited colonist. And we need one guy who's unemployed right now f to be our merchant when the time comes. Uh, so, shop. Yes, somebody crafted a shop for me. How nice of them. They had the stuff, uh, so one of my workers decided to just craft a shop. That's good. Okay, so it's time for the shopkeeper. Boop. You are now employed, unemployed wandering man. Where are you? Get to work, damn it. This ain't a charity. Get in there. Okay, so no coins, of course. Uh, let's see here. Now, I believe he buys for me just uh, flax seeds. When coins become available. And we're still we're using 145 food a day. We might need more food, too. Hmm. <laughs> Making this hard on me, game. Making this a little hard on me. Okay, you don't have any ore. You don't have any gold coins to... Uh, oh, you're making gold coins. You're making linseed oil now. Cool. All right, so let's see. Are we get any? No, not yet. This man basically buys linseed oil from the ether somehow. I don't understand it. I'm not going to try to understand it. It's fine. Uh, let's make... No, we got adequate food, I think. I think we make more than 145 food in a day, so I'm, I'm going to say we're safe on that front. We're not going to need a lot more people to experience everything we got on offer here. There's uh, gold ore being made. Good. That means coins are going to get made. Coins getting smelted. Coal's getting made. Good. Uh, not a lot I need to be doing right now. These guys are just crafting away just fine. I can't do anything with science yet, but we'll look at that in a little bit. Ah, yes, so he's going to buy flax seeds. He can also buy cherry saplings, uh, dirt, grass, temperate, wheat seeds, berry seeds, etc. But yes, he's going to uh, be buying my flax seeds, which is what I really need. They're kind of a bluish colored version of these berries. And we'll also need a flax farmer, which we will just build right over here, I think, right now, so that they'll have something to do with their lives. Flax farmer. Ten by ten should be good. Yes. Okay. And we're going to need another colonist to farm. You really not bought me any yet? There's coins right here. How many coins does it take to buy a seed, man? 
It's one seed! Yeah, make infinite coins, because that's fine. Uh, it's one seed! Just make me one, damn you. Like, get, what are you doing with your life? Get out of my way. Uh, yeah, he's just making stuff as he goes. That's fine. Yeah. Gypsum, red planks, black planks. Okay. All right. You doing anything yet, Chief? Got any flax for me? No. This guy is taking forever to get the flax. We've got coins. Where are the coins going if not to buy flax? What are you buying? Are you buying something stupid? Are you buying dirt or something? No, you're not set to buy anything else. Nothing else. Just buy the damned flax. He's gold coin 30. Oh, God. It's 30 per. You terrify me. It's 30 gold coins for a flax seed. Jeez. Okay. Well, I guess that's really the only use for them right now. So, I guess we'll be fine with that. We're just going to have to wait a little bit. I need to tell this fool not to make me any science labs right now. Can he even make science labs? No, I don't have coated planks yet, so I don't have to care. Yeah, you keep making that go. I guess I'm going to go mine some gold, because... Why is there negative one unemployed person? Again, what happened? Oh, because I made the flax farm and there's not enough people for it. Yeah, there we go. So we've got exactly the amount of people that we need right now. Now I'm just going to have to mine out some gold because you are not fast enough, buddy. You guys alive? Yeah, those bow guards are fine. Gotta be sure, man. I don't know what's going on anymore. I get scared easy in this place. Man, I'm the king. I shouldn't have to do this. I'm rich. Why do I have to work? I am rich, though. I've got like five gold coins now. Eleven! Holy shit, I'm getting so many gold coins. Doing good. Okay, so I think we're doing good on gold. That should get us where we need to be. All right. I'm going to go look and make sure that guy's not set to craft more merchant tables and uh, mints and stuff because I don't need more than the one of each that I have in storage just in case something happens. I also better get the hell out of here because it's going to get dark soon. Screw this. Nah. 150 food a day, so we, we're ending today with 775. So if we end tomorrow with 775, we're good. Plenty of arrows, 276 is fine. Uh, where's the work table? It's over here. Yeah, let's see here. You should make me exactly one of each of these things. Yes, you're fine then, good. The tailor shop, yes. Okay, all seems to be well. I could use a few torches. Do I have any? Yes, I do. Let's place some of these bad boys so that we can see what the hell is going on. There's a little light. Now we don't work in, like, disgustingly pitch dark. Here comes zombies. Oop. Yep. There, you're gonna take care of it. That room is lit. Light that side. Give them some light to work in this room and this room. See, I'm a good leader. I'm giving people light and shit. They have beds. They have light. And keep this room with a little bit of light. There we go. That's great. Best king ever. 100%. 10 out of 10 would vote for me again. I don't think you vote for the king, but that's beside the point. Uh, yeah, stuff's about where I want it to be in totals. Blah, 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 yeah. Okay. 
Let's just set it to make 500 arrows. That's a good level to not have to get higher than, I feel like. Okay, people aren't getting zombied this time. Looks like they got it under control now. I wish I could sleep and pass the night, but I guess that won't let me do that just in case zombies can get in and get somebody. This ain't Minecraft. There's other people to worry about. Uh, 30 gold coins for that. Damn, that's expensive. Sheesh. Okay. Uh, we got 13. We're going to get there soon at this rate. We got 13 gold ore, so we've got enough to make just about all the coins we're going to need for our first flax seed. And hopefully flax will beget more flax, and that will help us out a lot. Come on in and get shot, thanks. Yep, I see you there, buddy. Oh, he juked. Did you see him juke that shot? Just boop. Pow. Dead. Yeah, they must have got in this room and killed these poor fools last time. Some random people that worked in there. Yeah, I can see how that could be a problem. I wish I could make doors. Can make doors? There's no doors yet. Be something they could, like, take a like five or six swings to break or something. Why time for my guards to do their guarding? I'm going to end up with a guard who stands here and just shoots zombies that walk in. Looks like things are well under control here now. That's great. They're going through arrows like it's going out of style, but that's okay. We've got plenty. Okay, let me just uh, start working on the second floor here, I suppose. And don't worry, zombies won't spawn up here. It's too close to my colony banner for them to do that. So we're quite safe. Might stick a guard or two up here, honestly. Yeah, people get back to work. Good. Do so. And the gold is getting taken out, which means smelting is being done. Excellent, excellent. Well, I think we've uh, stabilized. Let's see if we have 775 food at the end of the day, because we might have a problem otherwise. <laughs> might be in a little bit of trouble then. Let me just head over here, knock down a tree or two for some extra planks, because I kind of took them all. There we go. And I'll just... Uh, Plop those right in there. Let me take some of those and finish that uh, roof in the first room. I know, man, you ain't got nothing to do. I'm going to get you there. You're going to be a priceless, valued member of this colony or whatever. There. That was more tedious than it needed to be. Okay. I should probably help with something. I don't know what I should be helping out with, though. Hmm. Gold's getting made. Yeah, I guess I should go get more ore. I can always use more. I think we are going to run low on arrows at this rate, so let me help out in the mines again today. It's hard being the king of this terrible little place. Probably harder being these poor assholes, though. Let's grab some iron ore. Let's probably grab some coal. Uh, where's the coal? There's some coal. How do we look on coal? Oh, we're, we're actually growing on coal, so I'm not too scared of that. Okay, then. We just drop this stuff off. That'll help our iron miner out. I'll go grab another tin. Get a little more. There we go. 
getting good on the coinage. Let's mine a little gold to speed it up. Two or three gold should be good, and then we'll just get a crap ton more iron and call it a day. The hell are you going? Oh, you're just dropping your stuff off. Okay, I was like, don't slack off, you little jerk. You work, you work forever. I forget, this is gypsum. What is this? That is clay, okay. I'm not sure what we do with clay. Probably adobe later. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's a lot of use for it right now. Is that no? It's coated planks, linen bag, yeah. Okay, we're gonna get our first uh, flax today, I feel. And how are we looking on iron? Boy, they go through iron like a beast. I will need to help with this. Thankfully, all this iron production has given us access to a lot of arrows today. So that's good. And food's up to 8.30. I think we're just fine on the food front. Uh, people have been eating it all day, and it's still growing. So we should be great with those four big farms that we've always had. And there you go. There's some more for you. Don't say I never did nothing for you. I'm getting the hell out of this hole. Keep working, minions. You're doing great. They're not doing very great, but don't tell them that. They get emotional about it. Especially the iron guy. Boy, he's not getting me nearly enough iron. I wish there were, like, upgrades for, like, tools so that the same person could do work faster. Maybe there is now. I don't know. I haven't really explored the, uh, the science system. What do we have here? It's, uh, regeneration speed for me, increases in my health and such... Yeah, that's a lot of stuff for health. That doesn't do me any good, because I don't have to care about that. So I need 15 points of science. Oh, look! He's he's wanting to do something. He's wanting to do something. Do we have it? We got 31. Where the hell's my seed? Did you buy it? Did you buy it? Where is it? He ate 31 gold. Maybe he's in the process of buying it. Let's check. Yeah, I think he bought it. I think he bought. Oh shit! They buy it by the hundreds. Oh my god. Okay, cool. You did good, chief. Thanks. Yeah, you're you're good, man. You're you're good. You're golden. Oh yes. Okay, flax is on the way. Flax man is planting it. He's planting the flax. Yes. Okay, we've done good. Look at all that. I didn't know you bought it in batches of hundred. I thought it was thirty gold for one damn seed. Okay, that's a lot better. That, that's exciting. Okay, we've got flax going on. All right, so that's a new resource we've accessed. Let's tell uh, the merchant man to buy, I guess, cherry blossoms now. Yeah. And keep us in, like, no less than 50 flax, I'd say, would be good. Now, this other stuff should be purchased. Uh, so when we get 10 gold, which should happen pretty shortly, he will buy us a, a, new, a new kind of tree. I wonder if you can get cherries from cherry trees or if it's just to make cherry wood. Because cherry wood is pretty. But I'd also like it if we could just get, like, special trees. Uh, let me see here. Forester, berry farmer, miner, flax farmer, weaver. No, there's no cherry picker or anything, so I doubt it. But we're going to be working, once this flax is good, we're going to make linseed oil. We're going to make a tailor shop. Oh, man, we're going to have a tailor shop. Make linen, carpet, clothing, and bags. I wonder what all that's for. And uh, we'll be able to make the science lab, the technologist table, which needs coated planks, which you make with, uh, I believe, linseed oil and planks. Uh, linen bag, we'll need that for the tailor, and yeah, we'll need all kinds of crazy crap over here, too. You gonna get done with all the planting before night falls? I hope so, man. That would be just boss. Also, you could probably 
do with having a crate handy, couldn't you? Uh, let's just plant you a crate right over here. And one for you. Good sir, right there. Probably would have been good to do that a lot sooner. And a crate for each of my berry picking guys. That speeds things up. Yeah, food's great. Uh, arrow's looking real good. I think we're okay tonight. I think we're alright. Yeah. That flax is going to grow for us overnight. Let's see what it actually takes to make those coated planks, because I can't make them. Only the crafter can. Linseed oil needs flax. He's going to make that. He's going to make coated planks. Just needs linseed oil and planks. Sweet. Linseed oil and dirt makes adobe. So I'm some gypsum. Planks and berry makes red planks. Okay. Planks and coal ore makes black planks. Well, that's cool that you have dyeable planks now. That's good. If you want to make stuff look real fancy, you can get red and black and regular and uh, coated. So that's nice. I like that. I approve of this. This is just not very safe for you. We're going to maybe board this up for the moment. Because if they come in this away, boy, it's just bad. <laughs> Until I can get a, a second story going up here and get some more beds on this floor. They're just going to have to make do down there. There we go. These guys don't know how good they have it. They're going to have a roof soon. I mean, a roof! Like, who has a roof? They're going to be able to work with a roof over their head. Not sleep with a roof over their head, because sleeping is not productive, damn it. But, uh, we'll get there. I mean, they're already living in the lap of luxury here. Let's look at this. But, oh my god, there are so many zombies. Holy shit. Okay. That's not good. That's more zombies than I anticipated. Uh, having 30 colonists is kind of scary, I suppose. Wow, look at them all. My guards are handling it, though. I can see why one guard was not enough there, but doubling it up has uh, certainly taken care of the problem. Let me just get this errant piece of roof out of your way. Boop. There we go. If I could maybe just storm out there and brave the dark to get some... Trees! Whoa, hey there, champ. This also helps prevent the zombies from uh, having so much cover from this forest as they come in from the side here. That's good news for us. And good news for our archers. Or our bow guards, if you will. make myself safe here while I take care of this tree. Thank you. There we go. Okay, I have gathered a little bit of tree. Gather a little bit more of tree. About tree fitty of them, I say. Ah, hello, zombie. Okay, I think we're done gathering tree. Tree is good now. Let's go. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, let's get in here while the getting is good. Okay. We've got... Let's just make as many of these as we can. You might hear the clicky sound because I have a new mouse and it is very loud. There we go. Today, while the flax grows, I will work. We've been running real long, though, running overnight, so I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye for now, everybody.